While the reopening of schools here in Vuani and surrounding areas has seen some improvements today, a principal at one of the local schools says today's attendance is encouraging. Learners have come to school, um, a few of them, but they are still, as you can see, they are still coming in. Seemingly, they are still hesitant. Grade 12, we, we have 140 learners, but right now we only have about 50 in class and they are very eager to start with their lessons but it's only myself and the science HOD who are here so the teachers did not turn up. I believe they heard over the radio that school should be starting but I really don't know why they are not here. Correctional services has been roped in with inmates assisting community members to clean up the classrooms. As a Department of Correction Services, we have deployed around 120 uh, probationers and parolees to come and assist in this uh, situation where we are cleaning schools. And we have targeted about eight schools today. Uh, we have divided the team. We have got the responsibility as well as a department that um, we assist in this situation that I, I think it's catastrophic. Four mobile classrooms have now been delivered at one of the local schools here in Vuani. The basic education department's Elijah Mshanga says it's now up to community members to ensure that they safeguard these classrooms. Well, the police are here for now to make sure that they are secured. But overnight we trust the community to take care of these properties because the police cannot be stationed here permanently. That is impossible, practically impossible. So. We hope that members of the community, with all the engagements that we've had, they will have seen the need to take up the responsibility of protecting these properties. It doesn't belong to us. It was procured using state money for the benefit of the public. We expect the owners who are the community in this area to take care of the mobile classrooms because this is about the future of their children. I feel happy the mobile classes are delivering and tomorrow will come and study at school. I feel so happy because I'm going to get education. The basic education department says more mobile classrooms will be delivered here in Vuani and surrounding areas to ensure that learning and teaching gets underway as soon as possible. Tando Kubega, Vuani.